Well, the Boys and Girls Club of Grand Rapids is a safe place where young people can find support, community, meals, homework help, friends, and fun. It is a lifeline for many families to keep those littles engaged all year long. And there is a very fun and exciting way to learn more about the mission and help support all the good work the organization does. We're talking about the Be Great Tailgate. We've got Patrick here. He's the CEO of the Boys and Girls Club. Patrick, thanks so much for being here. I'm happy to be here. Thank you. Yeah, let's talk a little bit more about the Boys and Girls Club and sure. all of the services. I mean, this is wide-ranging, and you help a lot of kids in our community. Yeah, yeah. We get uh, anywhere between 1,500 and 2,000 kids through our doors in a year. Um, we have three facilities across the city. We have the the West Side uh, Style Center, we have the Paul I. Phillips Center on Madison, and then we have the Seedman Center down on Crofton, uh, just north of Garfield Park. And then we also have a school-based site at Hope Academy, which again is close to Garfield right there. As well as Camp O'Malley, which is say, our... Camp? That's right, and we, we, so we just finished a season of camp out there, just wrapped that up a couple of weeks ago. We'll be having a Fall Fest, which I know we'll be talking about more in the future, um, in October coming up uh, for families to come out and, and see camp and just have a good Fall Fest time. Um, but yeah, so each of our three clubs and the school site, we're open uh, every evening after school. So it's a safe place for kids to be after school while their parents or the caregivers are, are still working. Um, we get them in, they all get a nice snack, they run off a little bit of energy from being in school all day. And then, uh, and then we get into an evening of, of various activities. So it's, it's uh, an opportunity for kids to uh, learn more about themselves, kind of develop those really healthy peer-to-peer -peer relationships off of screens. We do allow kids to play some video games here and there because, you know, it's a reward and, <laughs> sure. a, and a treat for them. But even there, we try and make it structured so it's about teamwork. It's about having those positive relationships with your peers. And then, really importantly, uh, having, having those relationships with caring adults. Um, so those staff that work at those clubs that really get to know the kids and get to know their families and their particular struggles and their, their wins and their recognition. And, and so uh, it's just a really positive place to be. It feels really good every night. Absolutely. All right. And so let's talk about Be Great. This yeah. is such a wonderful way for the community to step up to learn more about what this organization does and to help support them. So let's talk about the event. Yeah. So Be Great Tailgate, uh, I was just talking a lot about fun, is I think it's a really fun event. Uh, so it's, it's not at all stuffy. So it's what it sounds like. It's a tailgate style party uh, that we have at our West Side Club. Uh, they're the style center on straight. And uh, we have it outside under a big tent. Um, we encourage people to wear whatever their favorite team's uh, colors are. So we get a lot of people showing up in state and Michigan and all the usual fighting. Lions. Every now and then an Ohio State person somehow oh. gets in the door. We're okay with that. Um, I guess. They paid to come in. I guess it's okay. That's right. It's all for a good cause. <laughs> so we put aside our differences and we have a good time. Um, so yeah, it raises funds that directly support the Boys and Girls Clubs and all the programs that we do there. So that's next Thursday uh, from 5.30 till 8 o'clock again on the west side there. Yeah. And, and you guys have food trucks, drinks, yep. raff, lots of raffle items. Lots of raffle items there's a whole silent auction there's a little bit of a live auction that will happen um, last year we had our, our MC Michelle McCormick who happened to uh, uh, unbeknownst to the, the chief of police uh, who's our <laughs> board chair uh, auction off a ride-along with the chief yeah but luckily he played along and and, uh, and it went sport. very well he absolutely was. <laughs> So. The chair and the chief. Yeah, I mean, there were two. Yeah, <laughs> I, I right. remember that one. That was great. Yeah. So, um, and, and it, you, you have success stories there, too, because it's also Absolutely. an opportunity to hear all of the good things that you guys are doing yep. from the kids who've been there. That's right. That's right. And so this year we'll be joined by, by some of the kids from our Seedman Center. Um, actually, there's a, a dance team that, that is going to come out and perform. They've been practicing uh, all summer, so that'll be really fun. And yeah, it's, it's an opportunity to learn more about, about what it is that we do and, and hear from, directly from the kids that, uh, that come to the club every day. Wonderful. All right, yeah. well, let's get people there. Uh, coming up, September 12th, that's on Thursday, um, from 5.30 to 8.30 p.m. If you want tickets, you want to learn more about all of the things that are happening, bgcggrandrapids.org slash be great. We'll be right back.